All right, so here's the skinny. Uh, I've been working my ass off for the last two days straight. Damn near got a heat stroke. Uh, anyway, I was taking the car because I needed my trailer for the job. And I was taking my car to go put it in storage. And uh, as I'm pulling it up the ramps, it dies. And I can't get it to refire. I don't know what the hell's going on with it now. Ugh, just a constant source. It's a curse, you know? It's a succubus and a curse. Constant, constant source of problems. Absolute money pit. So, I winch it up on the trailer, take it over the storage. I'm like, the hell with it. I'm just going to put it in storage. I'll worry about it next year. I get it to storage. It fires up and drives off the trailer. And I'm like, you, you mother... <laughs> Yeah, I cannot figure this car out. I want it to run. It says, screw you. I'm not running. I say, okay, well, screw you back. I'm not driving you. And then it fires up. And it... Oh, I just... I don't... I don't... Don't you dare, dumbass. <laughs> that kid damn near killed himself right there. Okay. Uh, anyway. Uh, so there was a race that was supposed to happen on Friday. Today's Friday. Uh, I completely forgot about it. I'm like, screw it. I'm just going to go to work, do this job. I work my ass off doing this job. Put some bills in my pocket. And uh, as I'm coming back into town, one of the guys from my race group passes me. And I'm like, oh, hey, I recognize that car. I'm like, where the hell is he going? Oh, that's right. He's going to that race without me, fucker. But anyway, so I see him driving by, and I'm like, oh, I wish I could go to that. And then, then I'm thinking, why can't I go to that? The car was running last I checked. It's Friday. He's going. I'm off work. I only got three hours of sleep, and damn near got heat stroke yesterday, and did the same amount of work today. Why can't I go? So I loaded up the car. See if you can see it past my rifles. <laughs> Probably not. Anyway, and I am at the coast, and I'm gonna take this bitch on down to that track where I went the first time when I found out the transmission was shot. Race ready. So anyway, we are here, and hopefully we're gonna bust some damn ass. Hopefully. Get some more. damn day to get here. Uh, shit. I hope I went the right way. That is literally the dumbest goddamn thing ever. There is a fork in the road literally two tenths of a mile before the uh... fucking I gotta make a goddamn new turn on the highway. Come on, baby, follow me, follow me, follow me. There you go. There's a fork in the road, and I didn't know, do I go left, do I go right? I went right, nope, should've went left. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh my God, the fucking torment never ends. I was literally 60 seconds from pulling into the, the raceway. No, take the wrong damn thing, then I just turn around, and then I gotta turn around again. Oh my God. What the hell? Where is this place? Is that it? Looks like it says Speedway. That white sign. Looks like it says Speed... Yeah. Thanks, Autofocus. That's awesome. Fuck it. Yes. 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 Oh, whoop. I didn't realize I was filming the steering wheel. <laughs> yeah, baby. Yes, yes, look at all them people, I'm gonna kick their asses. Yes, yes, much deserved, much deserved ass whoopings. Don't hit that friggin' fence post.
there's the guy. This is the guy. The green car. So I don't know what was happening there. It wasn't reading my tire. Maybe I didn't line up straight. I don't know. But um, I need to get my crescent wrench <clears throat> so that I can adjust the uh, the fuel the uh, fuel pressure regulator. Um, I had a backfire through the carburetor at the the end of the run. I don't know if you saw that or not. Right before the finish line. I will tell you this. Even though uh, the car damn near wouldn't start. Uh, I'm just, I'm excited just to be here, you know what I mean? So even though technically I red lit so I lost the race, even though the car's still having problems, I'm still, I mean, I deserve, I deserve this little bit of happiness, goddammit. Uh, if anybody has any, uh, you know, if you know why it backfires through the carburetor, hey, put it in the, maybe it's the timing, maybe it's the fuel, I don't know. You guys know more than I do, so... Just a fucking dipshit with a YouTube channel and a really nice car. I mean, I'm at the track, and I didn't even get traction. I had to, I had to pussyfoot it just to get down the track. So uh, maybe I'll try a burnout this time if I can get the car to do it. Kitty here. What? Why'd you answer? You looked right. I the said fuck there. Anyway, that's the fastest guy in our group. And I was wanting to come out here and whoop his ass, but that didn't happen. Oh, come on, autofocus. God, stop it. close one I think they're saying yeah left lane so this is interesting we're sitting here talking we're talking about our mile an hour and everything trying to figure out who's faster between us two because we still got that rivalry going back and forth and uh, somehow the subject gets on uh, my car not being ready and I told him well I could bring my truck over here and I could run an extension cord over and charge battery up and then all of a sudden it just clicked to me and I said give me your battery and then, as I was thinking about that, then he says, well, shit, I can get you a battery. And then it dawns on me, I got three spare batteries in my trailer. I can pick any one of these suckers. Oh, mother fucker, that's the stinger on the back of the truck. Fuck. Anyway, I got solar chargers on my trailer, and I got three batteries in this bitch. They're all deep cycle. So even if one goes dead, I'll just swap it out for another one. Hey, you guys want to see some shit? Check that out, goddammit. Right on my shin because of you. Oh, oh you suck. Oh. 600 cranking amps. Shit, you know what? This is actually a smaller battery. It has less cranking amps than the one that was dead. Pass number two. Attempt number two or attempt number three. I fucking I lost count. This battery should have plenty. It says 13 on my voltmeter. You should have plenty. Let's do this.
Oh my god, I can't believe I beat him. Oh, and then I dumped the hazards on him. <laughs> I had to. I had to. It's been so long. It was a long time coming. I think I had tire shake going on when I was uh, doing my burnout. Truck, the car was shaking like crazy. They're going to race some quads. I guess they're bored or something. I want to see this. Oh, get out of the way, you loser. Blocking my damn view. <laughs> oh. I beat you, sucker. I beat you. That crown is mine. <laughs> I got so much gas inhalation. <laughs> I think there's still uh, an hour and 15 minutes left in racing. There's not hardly friggin' anybody. I mean, when I got, when I pulled in here, there was people everywhere. Now, now the whole damn field's empty. There ain't nobody doing races anymore. It's not even, not even 11 o'clock yet. I need to find out who the fastest person out here is so I can try racing them. Get my confidence up about this damn car. Apparently, my car's name is Disco. That's my car number. I don't know why they call it Disco. Maybe, maybe that's why they call it Disco. So I don't know what this is. Are you racing the gambler? I don't know what the hell that is. Anyway, um, July 7th, disco car, 4.6 reaction time. That's ridiculous. Uh, my 60 foot, one and a half, just under one and a half seconds. Uh, 3.30, 4.8, eighth mile, 7.5. I don't know what that ends up uh, working out. No, that, wait a minute, this wasn't my fastest. Wasn't my fastest run. Hang on. Left lane, 420, 1.6. Really? I had a better I had a better reaction. I had a better 60 foot over here. Uh 4.881. 4.852. What the hell? How'd I have a I was doing 92. Anyway. Yeah, I beat. I beat the guy. I beat our uh, fastest guy in our race group by 1.26 seconds, one and a quarter. Over here, I only beat him by almost half a second. But 92.09, still can't hit that 100 mile per hour. If I was doing quarter mile, I would have blew through that 100 mile per hour. 
Yeah, the car definitely needs to be dyno tuned. Uh, I was gunning the throttle all the way down to the finish line and it just, it, it, it didn't feel like it had the power it should have had for being the size engine that it is and everything and, and being the weight that the car is, the power to weight ratio that the whole thing had. So definitely, it definitely needs to be dyno tuned. And I probably need to go back in there and look at the, uh, the rockers again, reset the valve lash and do all that. Um, has a massive misfire. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to racing. I am your host, Cyrus54, and this is how your voice sounds when your car is spitting fuel down your throat. <laughs> oh my God, I've been awake. Uh, I got about three hours of sleep last night. Some damn cat was outside my window just screaming. It wasn't having sex, it was just, it, it's, it's like it was mimicking a, uh, an ambulance going by just just kept fucking doing that and it's like are you, damn it <clears throat> damn near got heat stroke yesterday and then worked my ass off again today made some money i was able to go to the races hell yeah and now my voice sounds super cool hell yeah i'm gonna get a i'm gonna get an announcing position as a radio dj Fun. That was awesome. Uh, 